So in the 2000s, a guy, a lady rang me up and says, listen, I'd love if you could talk to my brother. He wants to write a book. I said, no problem. I says, come to the, come to the Westwood Hotel, as it turns out, in Galway. We'll have a cup of coffee. I'll tell him everything I know about writing the book and see what happens. So the student arrives at the Westwood Hotel. Um, I tell him everything he needs to know about writing books. He says to me, what can I do for you? And I says, no, no, I'm very happy to help you. He says, no, 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 what can I do for you? So he explained to me that he designed websites. At that time, I had never had anyone on my website. So when somebody mentions website designer to me, I kind of go, mm, well, fantastic, OK. So, but he wasn't just somebody who actually designed websites. He had worked with Warner Music to create a community of supporters online for Madonna. He'd worked on one of the first three banks online. He'd worked also on one of the first magazines online. And he took over my website. And within three months, if you Googled personal development speaker in Google.com, I was number one for about five years. All because this student, student turned up and I taught him how to write a book. But was he a student? No. He was a student and a teacher.